It's your boy P-I-W-L right here rocking with HipHopWired.com. It's going down. Maybach Music Group, 7 May, May 23rd. Go and get that. Okay, then. Please talk about how fast this went down. Like, we heard Rick Ross signed you. Right. Next thing you know, we got a compilation now. This is like the fastest that an MC took people under his wing, and now ever, the product ever. is out. Like, talk Man, about that. first of all, shout out to the biggest boss in the game, Ricky Rose, mm -hmm. a.k.a. Ricky Ross, a.k.a. Teflon Don. Yeah. Hey, man, it goes down, man. I'm talking about, like, it just feels wonderful to be in the position that you always dreamed of. Right. And to actually elevate and, like, visualize it and, and it actually, like, materialize. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Because, like, most guys get you and they sit you down and you just sit around for right. a minute. But certain labels don't really know what to do with you, especially exactly. when it comes to an MC. But mm -hmm. <clears throat> somebody like Ross, he already understand it. You feel me? Because he's been in the game for years. And for him to grab us up right. and elevate us that quick, put the compilation out, mm -hmm. videos here, videos there. Like, I'm fresh out with video set. Came yeah. to the listening session. When I first signed to Maybach, guess what happened? Mm -hmm. Video, five, six songs. Wow. Next couple of weeks, a couple more songs. Boom. Goddamn photo shoots, flying to Vegas, going yeah. to Miami. And I was like, damn, the ink ain't even dry yet. <laughs> you feel me? So then, That's crazy. you know. It's, it's just a blessing, man. Yeah. I thank God, man. You know what I mean? No, I feel you. And the one, the video you shot today was for Pac-Man? That's Pac-Man. We did Pac-Man in Fourth Ward. Yeah. ATL. Hell yeah. Pink City. We heard Fort it. Street. <laughs> Auburn Avenue. Yeah. You know what I mean? It, it went all the way down, man. Like, I, I'm just I'm just honored to be a part of this whole situation. I'm very appreciative. We happy to have you, man, doing right. what you do, man. Right. Definitely. Um, You just shot a movie. Yeah. Talk about that real quick. Let people well, know I shot it. I actually shot it last year. But last like, year, okay. Uh, it comes out this year. The trailer has been released and all that, you know what I mean? So, yeah. like, it's called 96 Minutes. It's right. directed by Amy Lagos, and it's starring Evan Ross and Brittany Snow. Mm. It's based on true events. Um, I mean, it's just a bunch of teens, like, get caught up in the wrong situation. Right. And in 96 Minutes, their whole life changed. It's called Ooh. 96 Minutes. It's out probably a little bit later this year, mm. but it's starring Evan Ross. Brittany Snow and is directed by Amy Lagos. That's big, man. When can we expect the pill solo joint? Uh, probably the end of the year, if not the top of the next year. Because I'm just trying to make sure this is goes into fruition. I got mm -hmm. some more stuff coming with HBO, which is a TV series that I can't talk about now, but I still have a quick little role in that. Mm -hmm. And um, then again, I'm, I'm still reading other roles as well with the movies, and I'm working on the, the diagnosis, which is my mixtape. Wow. And then I'm working on the epidemic, which is my EP. And I'm also working on my album at the same time, which is the medicines. The man is working, man. <laughs> what, what can y'all say? You know yeah. what I'm saying? Y'all seen him, these double XL freshman things right. just took off, just kept going. Was that like the biggest thing for you up until at this? The time? Yeah, pretty much. And uh, getting a cover of the New York Times as well. Wow. That's you know big. what I mean? So, <laughs> That's big. That felt pretty That's good. Crazy. Yeah. Like headlining a few festivals solo. Right. You know what I mean? And not really having no. No big push behind me and yeah. just everything that's going on, period, when it comes to me outside of the traps of ATL or outside of the, the remnants and the ruins of Atlanta, Georgia. Because yeah, I come I from that and I come from the, 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 the depth and the gums yeah. and I'm able to actually rise up and, and show other people that it's, it's actually possible mm -hmm. for them to be somebody and actually take those circumstances that they're surrounded by and turn it into positivity. Right. So I'm just trying to set an example for those, you know what I mean? So yeah, I'm happy definitely. for everything that I'm accomplishing right now. I'm I'm very appreciative of, of Ross or Warner Brothers or anybody that ever listened to a tape or a CD or mm -hmm. burned it, bootlegged it, whatever yeah. they did. They helped my momentum go forward. So cool. shout out to all the people that, you know what I mean, been showing love to the movement since day one. I'm very appreciative of it. Cool, man. Uh, right. We heard you coin the phrase ham. I ain't going to go yeah, into yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, of but. course. Everybody knows that. <laughs> we know. We know. You can cool. Google that and see yeah. who. Well, tell them what's next, where to catch you, like how to reach out to you. Uh, man, we on the promo run right now. We in New York. We in Philly. We in L.A. We in Miami, we back down here, so we just getting everything done. Come mm -hmm. on for the album, so you can catch me in all of those places that I just named, yeah. and you can also catch me in your bitch. I'm just, <laughs> I, was just, I was just joking. That was a little humor. Talk to the, the rappers out there, like, right. like, how hard is it, you know, for them to for them to get where you are? Like, like, let them know what it took. You oh, for them man. I've been staying out for so long. I had to sacrifice everything. Like, I gave up on, you know, what I mean, on drug dealing and and. Mm -hmm. I stopped making money, so I was homeless, and I was going house to house. I was homeless for a long time, you know what I mean? Just right. pursuing my dream. A lot of people telling me no and telling me to stop, you know what I mean? Living in a fantasy world. Yeah. Telling me I'm lying when I say that I was doing this. So I, I took a whole lot of, basically, criticism for believing in myself or actually having a dream outside of the projects or outside of the streets that I was from. So, right. I mean, it just take a lot of hard work. It take a lot of 
humbleness. It take a lot of criticism from your peers or people that may love you that may not yeah. believe or actually visualize the same dream that you have. Mm -hmm. But like, it's basically you just got to be like, fuck everybody. Just do what you do. If you gon' if you believe in yourself, then because if you listen to what everybody else say, then you wouldn't be you. So right. it, it take a lot of long hours in the studio, packing up all your clothes and living in the studio, which I've done. This man times. lives in the studio. I've, yeah. I've seen him literally sleeping, waking up in the studio. Like, he does that. He goes right back to the so, studio. And going hard, man. Right. So y'all yeah. got to know what it is. Appreciate this man. Maybach Music. May 23rd is when it drops. Yes, sir. Yes, Self-made. Go cop it. Support. Rick Ross is really putting his artists out. He's not just signing them and shelving them. Right. So y'all got to really support that. The album is coming. This man is working. Movies on the way. All right. Like, I can't say no more. No more. Hey, boy, P I W L right here, rocking with HipHopWired.com. It's going down.